Hey everybody, welcome back. I got a really quick tip for you. Um, and I'm gonna tell you up front, I totally stole this from Sean Boba. Um, S-E-A-N-B-O-V-A. He's got a YouTube channel, check it out. Um, he gave me, we were kind of talking about um, nut files and how expensive they are and stuff. And he gave me this incredible tip. And uh, this is just a regular set of feeler gauges that you can get. I mean, they're five bucks. You can find them at yard sales for, uh, yes, less than that. But he um, made the suggestion that if you cut not a, cut a notch in a uh, in a feeler gauge, then you can use that as a nut slotting file. And because these are these are steel, and at first I thought he was kind of nuts, and then I tried it out, and so now I have a set of slotted nut files. If I was going to make another set of these, I would of course make would try to make my cuts regular. I, I made these cuts with a Dremel, um, which is not the best thing. You know, I've got a, I got a machine shop guy who, um, uh, I might, I'll ask him and see if there's maybe something that he can do um, and just to make the, the teeth more regular. But so this is, I have this from, so I start at five and then it just goes all the way up the line. And since I cut these teeth all at the same time, if for some reason I need to file an 11 slot and I don't have an 11, well guess what? I can put a five and a six together, the teeth line up, and it works pretty nifty. Um, is this gonna be my go-to for every time? Eh, probably not. Um, but if I need an in-between size um, from the files that I already have, uh, this is a this is a pretty slick solution. So if I need a 63, and they actually they work pretty well. Again, I was really skeptical about this, and then I tried one, and sure enough, now this is a, a pretty hard piece of uh, rosewood, and. Once you get it started, and uh, you know, Bob's your uncle. So that's just the quick tip for the day: set of feeler gauges, um, maybe a I don't know, maybe a hacksaw. Or, I mean, there are, there are certainly more elegant solutions uh, to getting these cut regular and a uniform depth. If you have an idea, um, you know, put it in the sermon notes down below and share it with the rest of us. Because this is a great way to save money um, if you're starting out and you just don't have gobs of cash to throw uh, for uh, slotting nut slot files. Because they ain't giving those things away, I'm telling you. So, um, yeah, so that's the tip for the day. Hey, I hope you guys have a great weekend. Um, cheers. Hey, if you like this episode of Rattle Can Guitar Restorations, you might want to check this video out as well. Be sure to subscribe to us on YouTube, and if you'd like to help the channel grow, consider stepping over to our Patreon page and giving that a look. Y'all have a good weekend. Cheers.